Hello guys and gals, we're back with more Microsoft Sudoku, and we have dailies to do for December 3rd of 2022. So, let's see what's in store for us. We have 28 days left. Oh, and we have a medium to do. Medium and two easies. Should be pretty easy overall, let's hope so. We need to clear seven ice blocks with 14 moves, that's fine. Let's first of all check 3, 6, 9, 12, 13, 14, 15. So, either way, yeah, not bad. So, ones. We're going to start with ones. And I see right away that this is a one. And we're going to do it because it's going to hit three ice blocks. And that's what we want. There. Not to mention, it's going to clear out one of these, these annoying ice blocks right up here so we can put stuff in here. One, two, three, four, five. We're missing a six. Conversely, we're also missing a seven, but okay. Uh, we know the ice block can't be a seven. Um, meaning that there's two possibilities for seven here. Interesting. Okay. So there are two possibilities for seven. So let's, let's note that. Because we know that this has the possibility of being a 7, and that this has the possibility of being a 7. Now, the other number that's missing is a 6, I believe. Okay, well, we have our answer. Um, okay, if I'm right, okay, 6 is the other option. There's a 6 here. This has to be 7. So, what we're going to do is... Um, that means this has to be some. This means this has to be six. So we're going to change this there. Um, that means this has to be seven right here. So, anyways, at least we figured that out. Now we know this ice block is a six. We can probably solve down here now. One, two. We're missing a three though. Okay. Well, this has to be three. Um, is it possible for me to hit two? I don't think so. We're going to mark this as 3, because we know that's a 3. Now, this has to be, um, okay, that's a 6. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. We're missing a 7. It means this has to be 7, and we're going to do it because it hits 3. So, let's do that. Wait, this can't be 7. Why can't this be 7? Oh, duh. It's because this ice block is 7, not 6. Okay, I see. Well, that, that cost us one of our moves. That's kind of a costly mistake to make, but... Anyway, let's see. This has to be 9. Yeah. Okay, now we can finally mark this as 7 so I don't get confused again. I like this mode, but you can't write on the ice blocks, so it's kind of annoying. You should be able to write on the ice blocks. Um... Okay, I don't know what this ice block is, but we can figure it out. It has to be a six. We're gonna say it's a six, which means that um, we have one, two, three. We're missing a four, and the four, okay. Okay, we can probably solve for this. So, what we have is, one, two, three, four, um, five. Okay, so this can't be a five right here. This has to be the five right here. We're going to do it because it's going to hit two blocks. So let's do that. There. Now we can solve for this, which is, uh, well, we're going to go notes mode. Oh, no, actually we won't because it's going to hit two blocks. So one, two, three, four, five, six. We're missing a seven, it, it seems like. So... Let's hit the seven. There we go. Now, um, let's see. If we keep going up here, we should be able to find another solution. Um, here, we need a two. Okay, I'm seeing two possibilities for two, which includes the ice block. That's not very helpful. Oh, we're also missing a four, which can't be the ice block. And it, the third number is an 8. Okay. So. 
I can kind of figure this out. So two is the ice block or this. Four is either this or we'll mark. We'll mark it. Four. This can't be four, but this can. Uh, and we're also missing an eight, meaning that. Um, Oh, this has to be four. Okay. Let's so we can get rid of this. Okay. Um, okay. So, we know this is four now, because it can't be two or eight, which are the other numbers. Um, I guess we can mark two or eight here and go from there. So, this is either two or eight. So, let's solve. For this thing, one, two, three, we're missing a four. This has to be a four, if I'm right about that. Five, and we're missing a six. We're also missing an eight. That means this has to be six. It means this ice block is an eight. Okay, which means that this has to be two. Which means that this has to be eight. Okay, so now that we know that, we should be able to solve this. I mean, right? One, two, three, four. We're missing a five and a six, though. Well, this has to be six. We're going to break that. Okay, so we need to hit this two more times, and we need to hit this once. Um, let's see. This had to be eight, so let's mark that. It might come in handy later. Uh, this had to be two, okay, and this has to be whatever's left over, nine, eight, seven, six, this has to be five, okay, so, we need to, oh, well, this is a seven, and this is a six, we can break this right now, let's do that, for right, yeah, seven, and then we can hit it again with the six, there. Now, we just need to solve for this, and the only way to get to it is right here. Now, we figured out that this was a 6, so we should theoretically be able to solve this. We have 1, 2, 3, we're missing a 4. That's unfortunate. Um, but maybe we can solve it with what else we need, which is a 6. Not so, okay, we, know, we already know that the 6 is right here, so we need a 9. Hmm. Okay. This has this is definitely a six, I think. I think if we can solve for the rest of this, then it'll, it'll make a difference. So let's see. One, two. Great. Okay. Two. Two. Three, four, five. We're missing. Oh no, there's the six right here. Seven, eight. Okay, so this has to be two. This has to be eight. Okay, now. This has to be six. To keep that in mind. One, two, three. Okay, we're missing a four and a nine. So we can mark that. We can go four, nine, and we can go 4-9. Now, since we um, aren't going to get perfect anyways, we're just going to brute force it and say this is 9. Lucky guess. Since we weren't going to get perfect anyways, then there's no need to actually just, you know, continue on that path. Okay, so next we're going to do, I guess, classic, because I usually save a regular for last because I find it the easiest. So let's go. And we're back, so let's see, we need to... Oh, clear three three by three blocks with fewer than three mistakes. Okay, what I see here is that we have something we can do. We're missing four and eight, so this has to be four right here, and this has to be eight right here. 
Now, right here, let's see what we got. Okay. Let me check twos real quick. Okay. Not very helpful. I see two possibilities for two. Wait. Okay, this has to be a two right here. Okay. Um, let's see if we can solve for anything else. Um, we just can't narrow it down. I do see two possibilities for two, though. I see two possibilities for two. But we're not going to mark them yet. I'm going to check ones real quick. Okay. One. I see two possibilities for one. Okay. I see two possibilities for one. Okay. I see two possibilities for one. Okay. Be nice if I can narrow these down, but I can't. They're just enough off that I can't. So let's check threes. This has to be a three right here. Okay. Let's see two possibilities for three. Okay. Let's see. Three. I see two possibilities for three. Nothing I can actually nail down, though. Fours are going to be especially difficult. Okay, I need a four. Ooh. Well, that's something, all right. But it tells me everything I need to know, and this has to be a four. And that means this has to be, um, three, I think. Wait. Yeah, because three takes out that, and three takes out that. This has to be a three. Uh, four, we're missing five. Okay, so, check fives. I see two possibilities for five. Okay. Oh, I see one possibility for five. It's right here. Okay. I see, okay, one possibility for five. It has to be right here. And we're missing six, which just has to be this. Okay. Now, um, we should be able to solve. Okay, three are missing. We need a two. Okay. We check twos. I see two possibilities for two. We might as well mark those now. Three, four. Okay. Let me check fours. Um, I see two possibilities for four. So we can mark those. Five, six. Okay. Let's see. This has to be a six. Seven, eight, nine. Okay, so two and four. This has to be a two. And this has to be a four. Now we should be able to, oh. I was getting ready to solve the rest of it. That wasn't too difficult. And we ended up getting perfect after all, so that's good. Okay, now a regular easy. Let's um, knock this one out. Three rows, fewer than three mistakes. Okay. Okay, they've given us some really good rows here. I'm impressed. So, um, what I see for starters is right here. We have two possibilities for two. Uh, also, two possibilities for three, which is not very helpful. Okay, now, if we go on up to this one, we can pretty much solve it. This has to be one, basically. No doubt about it. This is a one. Okay. Okay. This tells me that this has to be a one also. Okay, let's see what else we can figure out. 
Okay, okay. I see. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Okay, so here, this can't be one, this can't be one, this can't be one. That means this has to be one right here. And now all we have to do is figure out this, which this has to be one right here. Okay, now we're missing two from this row. And one of the numbers is two, so two. Um, four. There we go. It's one row. Now we can solve for this maybe. One, two, three, four, we're missing a five. This has to be five. Uh, six, seven, we're missing an eight. This has to be eight. Okay. Um, we could do this, but nah, that's okay. I think it's going to be just as easy to do this. One, two, three, we're missing a three. Good. Um, we should be able to solve this too. One, two, three, four, five, six, we're missing a seven. Okay. Um, oh, there's only two possibles, two possibilities here, and one of them is a two. That's fun. But we don't know what it is yet, so we're going to just mark those. Three, four, we're missing a five. Oh, this has to be two then. And this has to be five. Okay. Um, okay, we're only missing two right here, two numbers rather. One, two, three, four, five, we're missing a six. Um, I guess that we'll have to mark those. And we're also missing a seven. Well, that means this has to be six. And this has to be seven. Okay. Well, we're getting lots of columns out of this, and that's going to be helpful here eventually to get rows. One, two, three, four, five, six. We're missing a seven, it looks like. Let's see where the final seven is. I see. The final seven is right here. Okay. Now, we can probably solve for this. One, two, three, we're missing a four. Well, that's easy. Let's find out where the final four is. Um, let's see, okay, it has to be along here. There we go. Okay, let's see what else we got. Six, seven, we're missing an eight, it looks like. So, there we go. Now, um, let's see, okay, two possibilities here, and we are missing a two. We'll have to mark that. Okay, what else is missing? Three, four, five, six, seven, we're missing a nine. Okay. We're missing three from here. One, two, one of which is a three. Okay. And it looks like this has to be the three because it can't be right here and it can't be right here. So, guess what? This has to be a three. So let's see what else can be along here. Four, five. Okay. And this has to be whatever's left. Looking like eight. There we go. So, let's see what else we can do. Um, this is almost all done. Okay, let's check fives, because there's only one left. This has to be a five right here. And we win. Okay. And we get 300 points from that. close. We are at 2,800 of 3,000. Pretty good. And as you can see, we've done every single challenge today and every single challenge this month. So let's go back. That's going to do it for this video. If you like this content, make sure you like and subscribe and ring the bell so you know when I upload. Also, if you want to support me in any way, or if you want to join the Discord server, all that information will be in the description below. And as always, thanks for watching, everyone. You are loved, and have a great day.